Today, I challenged myself to build a SaaS startup in just three hours. This is how it went. First of all, I wanted to build an idea that you guys actually send me. So I posted about this challenge on Reddit, Twitter, and on my Discord server asking for some dumb ideas. But some of the ideas I got were really good. So I thought of building at least a decent SaaS app this time. I want to thank everyone who sent me their ideas. I was going through all the ideas and I really liked one. I got a DM on Twitter that asked me to build an app that would let other YouTubers preview their YouTube video thumbnails and title by just adding the title and thumbnail on our site before they actually upload the video. I like this idea, mainly because I thought that this is something that I could build in 3 hours, whereas some of the other ideas that people sent me might even take a year to build. Also, I felt that this was something that I would use personally myself. I want to explain how the app is actually meant to work. After the YouTuber makes his thumbnail and title for his next video, he can preview how the video would actually look like on the home page by just inputting the title and uploading the thumbnail image to our site. So I started by creating a name for the app. I named this Minul, Minul, I don't know whatever you call it, as I got this name literally from a random word generator. Then I actually started building by making a really simple landing page with just two inputs. One for taking in the title of the video getting previewed and the other one for getting the thumbnail image URL for now. I also added a really cute cat illustration that just looks super good. I went with getting an image URL for the thumbnail instead of actually taking in a file for form input as I didn't want to deal with any servers and also I think I didn't mention right. I'm really lazy. To at least make the user's process a little simple, I added a model pop-up on the website that shows them how to get the URL for the image they uploaded. I made use of this amazing image hosting site called postimages.org. Really cool. I then started working on cloning the YouTube homepage. By working, I mean literally copying the code from Web Dev Simplified's video on making a YouTube clone with CSS and then modifying it for our use. Thank you Web Dev Simplified for the video, it was really helpful. I hacked around this code for it to work for Minul and it finally kinda did. Now it works most of the time, although there are a lot of issues in the responsiveness of the page. I kinda felt that it was fine for now. So now I moved on to build more sections like the search page and the subscription page as they are pretty important for getting attention too, right? I basically modified the home section that I previously made for these sections. It just took me around 20 minutes to do that. So now I had to figure out the length, like how many characters of each title are actually shown on the YouTube homepage. I did a bit of googling and just calculated the length of each title I saw on the YouTube homepage and finally got it. I then used some JavaScript on the client side just to remove the extra characters of the title inputted by the user which should not be shown on the page. I then also made sure that the image URL inputted by the user is actually visible on the homepage preview. You know, I could have made it so that the 16 is to 9 ratio for YouTube thumbnails stays the same for all the images uploaded, but I simply didn't because as I mentioned earlier, I'm really lazy. I think most of the functionality of the web app is basically done. I just had to deal with some form requests on the front end and some bugs with that, but I finally completed it. I then polished the rest of the app and made it look good. Speaking about polishing, I added a bunch of totally real and honest testimonials with some really bad jokes. Mike Hawk wrote, This app saved my life and I can't imagine what I would do without it. After I finished this horrible web app, I then finally hosted the website on Netlify. It was really easy to set up. I then had to just get a domain. You know, I could have probably got a .ml or a .tk domain for free, but I felt like I had to really buy one. So I then went to namecheap.com and then typed in Minul and literally selected the cheapest extension, which was the .xyz domain. Minul.xyz it is. I then took care of the DNS stuff on Namecheap to point to the Netlify servers who are hosting the files for Minul. The web app is finally done, all in under the time of three hours. Now I had to launch this app. By launching, I mean posting on Twitter, Reddit and on my Discord server and finally also announcing it on Product Hunt. My goal is to just get some honest feedback. If you guys don't know what Product Hunt actually is, it's basically a Reddit for discovering new tech and apps. Many huge companies announce on Product Hunt and get a huge response. I don't have much experience in launching on Product Hunt, so I asked a few of my friends what to do. I then made a list of things to do before launch. On Product Hunt, you basically have to upload a bunch of videos and images about the product. So I asked my friend to make me some graphics for the launch and he did a really good job. He made this really awesome cat animation for the cover image 
and then we also made another shitty meme video just like the last time we made for session fix i then took a bunch of screenshots of the app for the page the only step left to do was to launch and i knew it wouldn't be that easy i added all the details and then scheduled the posts on product hunt for tomorrow the day finally came my app went live on product hunt and just to get more people on my page I also announced it on my Discord server, Twitter and also on a few subreddits. The support was way higher than I expected. The post did super well on the subreddits I posted on. Twitter really liked the video we made and the final goal was to just make it to the front page of Product Hunt. This was even simpler than I expected. Many people really liked the app and I got some amazing feedback except a single weirdo who thought it was some video marketing tool for businesses and downloaded my app on Product Hunt. At the end of the day I was literally on the hero section of product hunt. I got the fourth product of the day which is a huge success in my opinion because this is literally the first product launch I did on product hunt. Here are the analytics. I had over 450 page views and a really diverse set of audiences on my app. According to Panel Bear which is the analytics app I use around 153 people came in from product hunt and the rest are from Twitter, Reddit and from Google. Thanks again for the amazing support on Twitter, Reddit, Discord and on Product Hunt. You guys literally made my week. I was attending my online classes and I built this as a result of me getting super bored. Now, you can watch this video about how I started my old startup sessionfix.com on the screen right here. Thank you for watching.